the dark thing. If we find the horse, can we clone you, Pippa? So we can have our own... Our own Pippa Pipkin to ourselves? Is that too creepy? If I die, you are free to create... Recreate me in AI or... Whatever. And I don't care. Speaking of... Speaking of AI... <sighs> speaking of AI, did you guys see somebody... Allegedly, I don't know if this is true. Maybe it was just a shit post, but somebody made... Somebody somebody had a research paper and they named it Pippa. About AI. Yeah, Pygmalion. Yeah, I clicked on it. It's the people it's the people behind Pygmalion. It's crazy. It's a small world. I've talked about Pygmalion on stream. If it's the same one. Hold on, I'll get a I'll get a screenshot. Um So posted by CEO Foggy, my AI friend really named an AI research paper after Pipkin Pippa. And if you click on the Discord screenshot, it says it's from Alpin, and it says, Yo, not sure if you saw this, but we released an academic research paper the other day. Had a little fun with the title. And then when you actually click on it, it's Pippa, a partially synthetic conversational dataset. With the emergence of increasingly powerful large language models, there is a burgeoning interest in leveraging these models for casual conversation and roleplay applications. However, existing conversational and roleplay datasets also often fail to capture the diverse and nuanced interactions typically exhibited by real-world roleplay participants. To address this limitation and contribute to the rapidly growing field, we introduce a partially synthetic dataset named Pippa. Personally, our personal interaction pairs between people and AI. Pippa is a result of a community-driven crowdsourcing effort involving a group of roleplay enthusiasts. The data set comprises over 1 million utterances that are distributed across 26,000 conversation sessions and provides a rich resource for, resource for researchers and AI developers to explore and refine conversational AI systems and the context of roleplay scenarios. And if you actually go to it... Robot Pippa is forever! Robot Pippa is forever. Robot Pippa is forever. This really blew my mind! I sent it to Saka now, I was like, whoa! And, and I, I think he was concerned. I think he was concerned. But, um... Yeah, by Tyr Gosling, Alpen Dale, and Yin Ha Cheng. Is that how you pronounce that? Y Cheng? I I'm sorry, I don't know how to say your name. Um... And if you go to it... Tyr Gosling and Alpen Dale are from Pygmalion AI! It's crazy! It's crazy! It's crazy! I'm gonna have to do another AI stream. Gosling rules. Check all their name. Little Gosling. Yeah! Tear Gosling! Literally me. Literally you. <laughs> it's crazy. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It's just so cool. It's just so cool. If it actually is, I don't know if it's like actually named after me. It could just be, it could just be like coincidence or whatever. But it was actually named after me. I'm honored. That's so cool. That's so cool. It can't be coincidence. I don't know. No, it actually was named after you specifically. Oh. So, Pygmalion, do you wanna... You wanna... You wanna do a collab of some sort? Huh? Huh? <laughs> Confirmed by them to be named after you. Termoshi was used, really? I didn't see that part. I didn't see that part. Probably is, people always want to have fun naming their projects. It's character AI logs. They did it after you. You confirmed it! Ah! Have you been a bad boy? 